Guys, I'm so excited. I don't know if you can tell, but today we're reunited. We're doing another little, well, little. We're doing a pretty big, pretty decent size Zara haul, and I can't even tell you how excited I am. I found some blazers, some work pants, some cute little spring outfits. Girls, I'm ready for the summertime, but I wanted to do a Zara version, like for the spring, a Zara haul for the spring, and then I'll do another version for the summertime with even more colors, even more bright and bold patterns. But today I'm keeping it a little bit more neutral, but I do have some really nice pairs of pants. Jeans, you have to stay for, you know those famous TikTok jeans? Girl, I got them. And I'll tailor down the sizing for you. I'll tell you all the details. So stay tuned. Make sure you watch the video the whole way through. Make sure to subscribe to my channel if you do enjoy content from me. And also drop a thumbs up if you do enjoy this video. With further ado, let's hop into the pieces. Guys, so let's get started. And of course, feel free to style the pieces however you want, whenever you get them, if you get any. But I thought I would break this kind of formal blazer look with a jumpsuit that I got from Zara. This is my first time actually ordering like something like this. I don't know if it's a unitard or if it's just a jumpsuit. Um, but this one is full length and it has the, I'll show you without the blazer, or jumpsuit or whatever you want to call it. It's black. It's in this beautiful ribbed material. I'll get closer. It's very, very stretchy and it's actually too big for me. I got this in a size small and I'll have to check the tag. And it's $39.90. I got it in a size small and I think it was one of those where it's only like size small to large. And I do think it's flattering, like mostly because of the, the cut on the chest area. But like, I feel like even this area is very big for me and I'm not big chested. So I feel like maybe if you're someone who has like larger boobs, then it would fill it up better um and i do think like there's a lot of excess material at the waist but it, what i'm thinking i'm gonna do with something like this is potentially actually put a belt to sort of like cinch the waist in all right guys so i've put on a belt and i'm actually in love with the way this looks with a belt um this belt I got it such a long time ago from Boohoo. It was so cheap, it was like five bucks or six bucks, I don't even know. But it's one of those where you, you like tie it at the back. So like I went completely around my back and then I like tied it at the top to fix myself um but i feel like it makes it look like just so much more flattering and i'm um, the body like my body shape is set up in a way where if i don't really accentuate my waist because i'm very short i end up looking like a potato very fast depending on the kind of clothing that i wear so i really like when like things sort of accentuate the waistline if that makes sense um we all do what we gotta do you know we know our bodies so we try to like make the pieces work with how our bodies look. So anyways, so I really like it picked together. Um, again, you don't necessarily have to wear heels like that with this, but I feel like just dressing it up with heels and with this little belt makes it like look so much more expensive. So I've put on the next little outfit that I got. And if you do, I need to do a disclaimer, I think in every video, if you see some sort of redness on my skin, do not be alarmed. I have rashes, I've been dealing with hives for a few months now and it's really annoying but yeah just FYI um so this I believe is called the ottoman set so this is the ottoman blazer and then there's also a pair of shorts that comes with it and then I also paired with it a little bralette um that I got from Zara as well it has a very beautiful finish it's like a rib, a rib detail the only thing is it came broken and I'll try to show you guys but like yeah like this side came broken so technically there should be two straps here um but they're not attached to the side if that makes any sense so that was highly frustrating um on zara's end to sort of like mess this up but the idea that i had in mind for this the you know like the suit to work together with a little bla with a little blazer as well as a little bralette is still i think like solid like you can still picture out what I wanted to do and so these are the shorts these are the ottoman shorts I'm wearing them in a size extra small which actually fits very well it fits my waist so nicely um I'm really really surprised and I'll show you guys better like this those either are shorts and what I love about them is the length because they don't like I really don't feel uncomfortable or I don't feel like my butt cheeks are like gonna be hanging out of them i find them really really flattering and i feel like this oatmeal color with a tan is gonna look fabulous right now i paired them with some white heels and i feel like it just looks very beautiful and then this blazer this is different from what i usually go for because this is more of a oversized fit and typically i like a very fitted blazer and actually i got this blazer in a size extra small so just 
FYI, if you're like similar to me and have similar measurements, again, my measurements are gonna be down below. Just be mindful. So this is it if you wanna wear it loose, baggy and open, but you can also do a look where you're like cinching your waist in because it does have the belt. So let me do this real quick. And also do a look where you're like cinching your waist in kind of like this I only like I wish it had the real pockets but it doesn't um but I also really like this look let me know what you think like do you like it better um loose or do you like it better fitted I really really love this I just wish the bralette wasn't broken but Okay guys, so up next, and I actually had shown a preview of these two little items in one of my last videos, so I'm gonna go really fast over them. But I got this top in a pink color. It's like a beautiful silky finish top, and then it's fully open at the back and adjustable. You just have the two little straps. I think this top is super famous. And I got this one in the pink, and I also got it in the white, which is this one. In the white, I got it in a size extra small because all the other sizes were out, and then I got this pink one and the size medium because all the other sizes were out. I don't think it matters that much, uh, at least on my frame, it's pretty much the same. So I'll show you guys the white one with an outfit as well. But I did also want to show you guys the short in case you guys were interested. Again, this was introduced in one of my last videos, but it was only for a little snippet. So I'm putting it here in case you guys are interested. These are some like jogger shorts, if I can say that. So it's tight at the waist because you have a very thick, beautiful waistband. I got these in a size small and I believe these were $25.90 and then the little tops were $35.90 and then what I like about the shorts is again it's a very nice length I don't feel uncomfortable obviously I would totally not pair these together I would wear this with something a bit more dressy and this you can easily just pair it with like a seamless little top from Zara or just anything else and with trainers because I look really cute don't mind my toes right now I don't know much, how much you can see them but they're completely undone um, but yes one of the things I was so excited to try, but I was also super scared to try because we all know Zara jean sizing is, well, Zara sizing in general is very, it's off. You know, just the fact that a medium and an extra small and me fit the same kind of thing with the shirts, it just tells you a little bit about it. But I got these super famous TikTok jeans. I forget the actual name of them. Let me see. These are called the high rise wide leg jeans. I got these in a size six. So I actually sized up because these I think are 100% cotton. So every time the material mix is literally only 100% cotton, I always size up. Typically I would be a size four if the jeans has some stretch so this is a size USA 6 which is a European 38 these ones retailed for $59.90 so I guess that's a little bit more pricey in terms of their size in terms of their pricing for jeans but the quality is very very good and this is also like the perfect shade of blue for the summertime and then it does also have um, I think it's yeah it's on the knee has like the knee rib details it doesn't come cuffed this is what I had done because I filmed a TikTok the other day and I was just trying to show people how long it was on me because again for reference I'm 5'3 and I think these are very like tall girl friendly but not so much midget friendly but there's ways to go around it and because it's like a fully raw hem at the bottom it's super easy to just cut and get it sized the right um, fit for you the right height for you and you can also roll it until then or wear like super high heels I'll show you guys different ways that I can wear them and let's get into these ones So I've tilted you down a little bit so you could see the jeans on as you can tell They're super freaking long on me, but I do like the way it holds me in at the thighs Honestly, if I had gotten a four, there is no way I would have been even able to put on this jean because it's super tight like currently it's like compressing my butt um and it's like tight around here but the thing is like i'm not too worried because i feel like the more i wear them the more it's going to start stretching out around here that's often what happens with like cotton fabrics um and then the other thing of course is like it's too big at the waist because i had to go up a size but that i don't even really mind and honestly sometimes i feel like when the waist is a little bit big but that the thighs fit it kind of looks 
like your waist is, is even smaller than it is, if that makes sense. Cause like the one thing that I hate is when like I have jeans that are way too tight in my waist and then it looks like I have like a muffin top type look. So anyways, so these are them with the fold length. As I said, it does have the rip on the knee. It also has like a cute little detail over here. Same thing on the other leg. And then I'll show you guys them with heels on and what they look like. I'm not gonna bother closing my shoes, but I'll show you guys. And because I'm so short, it's barely gonna make a difference. <laughs> That's the funny part. Okay, so that's so funny. I just put heels on them. There's literally no difference. Like, I'm gonna get them cut and tailored for sure. Okay, guys, so I've put on the next little outfit together. Um, this seamless top is actually made of a very nice, thick, seamless material. I think I featured it in a little snippet in my last video. Um, but the main piece and the thing that I just recently ordered is actually these jean shorts. Um, I actually don't know how I feel about them because the sizing to me is off like it's it's big at the waist but the thing is like it's very short like right now i feel like my butt cheeks would just be like hanging out and i wouldn't feel comfortable wearing this down the streets type thing um so i actually sized up in these shorts too so it's also my fault um but i got it in size six typically i guess i would be a four but again like this is 100 percent cotton so i just didn't know how stretchy it would be and how like my thighs and butt would fit um, so currently it is big at the waist. I don't think it does anything for the booty. <laughs> I don't think it's flattering at all. Um, but again, I don't find a lot of shorts flattering at least on me. So maybe that's just like a me thing. You let me know. Um, but otherwise, like I love the look of them in the sense like I like the frayed bottom and I like the uh, wash of the denim. But I just don't know if I would keep them. Maybe I need to order like one size down to have it like, you know, like more cinched at the waist and maybe like I like it better that way. Um, but then I just feel like it's gonna be even shorter on the butt and I feel like I'm not gonna feel comfortable wearing these, you know? So that's that. Um, but just so you know, these jeans were, so I got them again, I got them in a size six and they were $39.90. And then at the top was, Oh yeah, so the top of the price is in euros, but it was 10 euros. And then the size was size extra small, small. It's like the range of sizing. So that's this fit. And now I'll show you. All right. So the next thing that I got is actually this little dress and it's really not my style usually like i don't usually go for something this girly and floral and like pinky but i really really like this dress the only unfortunate thing sorry i'm trying to like fix myself the only unfortunate thing is again like zara sizing is kind of off like in terms of like the sides and i took a size extra small but i don't know why this is like has so much space here but i guess again if you're like bigger chested you may fill this up much better um but i might have it like just taken in a little bit so it really cinches my waist in. I find this part really flattering and I just love how flowy it is. And it's just like very flirt flirty and like cutie. And the back is completely open so you can just like adjust the strap. And I feel like the length of this is actually perfect. Like this is not too long, not too short. This is the perfect little dress to go on like a picnic date or like a little brunch date with your man, with your girl, whoever, with your girls, go on a little brunch. Like I love this. And also in terms of the material, it's like a beautiful, silky, um, super soft fabric, but it's also like double layered. So there's no like see-throughness issue. And then the strap though, I am gonna warn you, like this is not adjustable. Like it doesn't, you can't pull it to tighten the, the arm, it's stuck together in here, if that makes any sense. Which is kind of dumb, because I feel like they may as well just have made the whole process um, adjustable, but they didn't. And then in terms of price, oh, there we go. <laughs> I couldn't feel the tag. So I got it in a size extra small, and this one was $39.90, which honestly, for a dress like this, I find is very good. The quality is really, really there. I like the sizing. The only thing is like I would get this taken in, but otherwise, I think this is very cute.
Okay guys, so on a similar note to the first black jumpsuit unitard, I got this one, which is again a one piece. I did like the fact that it has like the zipper detail so you can open it as much as you like or keep it closed all the way up to your neck. Um, I really liked the material of it. This is a seamless, it's like a ribbed, a thicker like ribbed fabric and I found that the color would be nice with a tan in the summertime. The only thing is I feel like it's super ill-fitting so that's why I'm actually wearing it with a belt right now to try to give me some shape and like cinch me in a little bit because the thighs and hopefully you can you guys can see that but like on my thigh it's like super tight like around around here and like I do have large thighs but the thing is like I got this in a size uh, medium to large just because I knew it may be tight on my thighs. So it's just kind of like, I feel like the sizing is still a little bit off. Um, I don't know where I would wear this or like how I would wear this. So initially I was actually gonna return it, but then my smart self stained it. I don't even know how, but there's like this big stain here. So I'm like, whatever, I'm gonna keep it. Um, I got this again in the medium to large size range. It's the one where it's like extra small, small and medium to large. And this one was $35.90. I'm sure I'll try, like I'll find a way to wear it, but I just like, I don't know. I feel like the sizing is a little bit up for me. I do like it much better with the belt on. Um, so that's that. I think I could rock it with like a cropped, maybe like a crop jean jacket or something like that. And I feel like I'm wearing heels right now in case you guys can tell, but like, I don't even know. I don't know where I'm gonna wear it or how I'm gonna wear it, but if I do, I'll let you guys know. Yeah, so this is the next little outfit that I've put on and I love, love, love this fit. Now, I don't think I would pair the two together necessarily, but I wanna show you guys both pieces. So this, let's start with the top. This top is the same as the pink top from before, but it's just the white version. So it's the same price at $35.90. And then this one, I, as I said in the beginning, this one is a size extra small and the pink one was a size medium. Again, you do have the nice open back detailing so you can fully adjust. Um, and there's actually like a little plastic thing. Um, so that's the top, but then moving on to the start of the show, at least for me in this outfit, it's those pants. I love those pants so much. Now keep in mind, because I'm sure it is running a little bit too long on me, so I'll get them hemmed. Um, but this is actually a rock edge on the jean, and these are a size 4, and it does have a little bit of stretch, so that's why I actually went for a size 4. And I also actually ordered them in a size 6, so I'll bring these closer so you can see. They retailed for $49.90, and these are the Ecru Slim Slim Fair High Rise. I don't really see anyone talking about them. I only saw them, like a girl trying them on in one of her jean try on haul. And so that's why I picked them up because I was super interested. And the color is an ecru, so it's kind of like a cream color. And I don't know if you guys can tell, but it reminds me of like when you buy almost like French vanilla ice cream and it has the little vanilla um, grains into it. Like that's what this reminds me of. So this one is a size six. I do find that the size six is actually too big on my waist. But um, I don't know how I feel about keeping the size four because I love the waist on the size four, but I feel like it's too tight on my glutes and on my thighs. But then the size six is almost the same tightness on my glutes and on my thighs, so it, like it doesn't make sense. But I feel like as I wear them, they're gonna stretch out. And as you can see, like it has the split on the side, which I find super nice. Again, they're like too long on me, so don't, don't just them for face value right now, but. Yes. So the next thing that I got is this blazer. I paired it with the same pair of jeans that I just mentioned. And I'm in love with this blazer. I'm so in love with it that I also got a white version, so I'll show it to you guys. I just paired it with one of my Babaton crop tops, you know, the ones that are like um, sleeveless. It's like a nice, really, a really nice tube top. And I just, I love this blazer. Like, I don't even know what to say about it. It's just so nice. Um, it's a beautiful taupey color, I would say. It has long sleeves and it has a nice little like split detail at the end of the sleeve and I feel like that really adds to it. And I just find it super flattering. I got this one in a size extra small and this one was $79.90. 
Um, I don't know if I removed the tag. Yeah, so I got this blazer in a size extra small and it was $79.90. I feel like you can pair it with jeans, you can pair it with like actual work pants, you can pair it with shorts, you can make it work in so many different ways. And that's why I absolutely love, if you guys don't know, I love a good blazer. Like I'm always on the hunt for a good blazer, like at work in the office environment, I typically wear blazers every day. Although I know it's COVID, I just like stocking up on blazers. And this one, you can actually close it as well if you wanted like so, but I feel like most often and I, I would actually wear it kind of like open like this and if you guys have watched my last uh, um, 10 looks inspired by Pinterest video I do also feature this one in it um, so yeah so it's just cropped all the way around and I feel like it's just it's just so nice because the structure is here it also has like a very beautiful lining detail on the side over here as you can see and I think it also has a nice lining detailing at the back is just a beautiful staple color to have in your wardrobe again because it's neutral it's super easy to pair with a whole bunch of things i could also picture a very beautiful dress like a white dress under this like maybe like a silky material i feel like that would be super pretty so let me show you guys because i also got it in a, in a white version so let me show you guys what that looks like. all right guys so as i mentioned i love the taupey color so much that i also got the white so this one is the white version it's the same same exact concept is the same length on the sleeve which is pretty long for me and I really really like that look it still has that beautiful like split detail on the um, cuff area and it's just so flattering it does have like very small shoulder pads so it gives you that structure but I actually find it very nice because then it looks like it kind of like comes in the waist with the way that it's structured again with this one you can just close it um, like so but I would actually think that I would wear it open like this this one does have also a different color of button it's like a kind of a yellow brown color um, but I just love the fit of these I love the way that they're cropped it's just super flattering this is a way a super good staple to have in your wardrobe super easy to pair I do think that it also comes with a skirt so you have the matching set with the white or with the toe the, the thing is like I'm not really the type to wear a skirt um, so I just really want to just the blazers and I feel like I can pair them super easily with jeans or um, some other sorts of bottoms anyways so these are or this is the white one again I got it in a size extra small and yeah a beautiful structure I feel like I'm gonna wear these time and time again so I'm just super happy about the investment and honestly $79.90 for a good structured blazer like this it's not that bad actually this pair of pants and I've actually been meaning to get these pair of pants because I think they've been on the websites and then they, they get sold out and then they come back in style and I know they have so many different colors of them um, and these ones I forget the name of them but they retail for $49.90 and I got a size small I also purchased a size extra small to see how it would fit and I loved it on the waist but it was unfortunately too too small on the thigh so I went with a small and I feel like the small is still good um, it could be a little bit more snug on the waist but I feel like it still does the job and I think like with the lining um, in the stomach area it becomes very flattering I also love that these are still um, short girl friendly so even if I remove my heels right now it'd still be a nice length and I would feel super comfortable wearing these pants to the office you can very easily pair them with a nice little crop blazer or a long blazer you can do so many looks with them um, they're just super flattering again they're super high-waisted you have the zipper going all the way they do have different colors that I kind of want to try I know they have like a light Pink, a light blue they also have like a sort of camel color um, so I feel like these are very good staple pants they're just very well form-fitting and they just also have very good quality so I would highly highly recommend them this is just a 360 of them and I do find that they're like quite fluttering but not too much so it's still very work appropriate um, obviously I wouldn't go to <laughs> I wouldn't go to with the office with a two top but um, yeah I love these ones okay guys so the last pieces that I have are actually pairs of pants 
and I got four pairs in two different styles so two colors of each style and I feel like these are really really great staples for the summertime but also beyond that that you can wear to an office environment but that you can also dress very like fancy for a dinner um, so I feel like you guys would really like them and I also feel like these are super underrated I don't really see anyone wearing them in their hauls and the reason why I know of them is because I actually had one of the version like one of the colorways that they did in the past and I bought them in October they were actually featured in my fall video but I thought I would feature them again and so let me show you the first style that I got which I absolutely love and honestly I think they've become my favorite pair of sort of work pants um, so it's these ones I picked them up in a very pretty cream sort of off-white color they may look a little bit see-through, but they're not see-through, um, at least from my perspective when I put them on, they're not see-through. And I did get them in a size extra small and they retail for $59.90. I think a size extra small is perfect for me because it's snug at the waist, but it's still like a perfect fit on the leg and I don't feel uncomfortable. It does have the belt loops, so if you wanted to add a belt, you could do that. And it's just so beautifully finished and it does have beautiful tailoring detail as well. You have like that lining going all the way down the leg in the front. And then same exact thing goes for the camel version, which is the second pair that I picked up. It's this one. It's so gorgeous. Again, a very easy color to wear in the summertime. And this is a light fabric so i feel like it's going to be super breathable and because it's super it's supposed to be more of like a straight leg it's not going to like stick onto your skin and you're not going to feel uncomfortable or start sweating in the summer so i feel like this is perfect again i got this one in size extra small same pricing i believe 59.90 um it's just so beautiful again it has the belt loops you have that lining detail in the front so i'll show you guys them on a so, sew excuse my rash is going completely out of control but these are the first pants on so this as i mentioned that's the lighter color that i got in size extra small the only thing they don't have pockets but i don't really have an issue with that um again i find them so gorgeous like these are by far one of my favorite purchases from Tudis haul to be honest i feel like the haul was pretty successful so i feel like i love like a lot of the pieces but these are just so gorgeous the only thing i would say is i could like um, rectify the sizing a little bit, but I feel like they work very well. They're so beautiful. Like, you can so easily pair this with a beautiful little blazer. Um, I'll show you guys, actually, I'll put on one of the blazers, but they're so, like, they're, I find them very, very flattering, but it's still super appropriate for the office, family setting, or if you wanna dress a little bit more formal. And I feel like you can still also break this style down and dress it down or dress it up as you need. The only thing I will say though, um, and reminder, cause I'm really short, I am wearing high heels right now and they're still super long. So I will be getting them taken in, but I mean, I'm so used to it by this point, I'll be bringing my whole order in <laughs> and get them taken in, but I'm not bothered at all. I feel like the fit is just perfect overall other than that. And I just want to show you guys the camel version. I've put on the camel version of the pants. These are again, exactly the same, but just the camel version size extra small. Again, Again, they do actually, I don't know how much you can tell from where you're standing, but they fit a little bit tighter on the thigh, but nothing dramatic. I feel like they still work. I feel like they actually pair very well with the crop top that I'm wearing right now. Um, and again, with any sort of blazer, they would be super easy to pair. I just find them so flattering, just so elegant. Um, I love me a good pair like this. Again, I'll get these taken in a little bit at the bottom, just like the other ones, but otherwise I heavily, heavily recommend them. This is them from the back. Um, don't mind the rashes, but I find them very flattering and just very elegant, very womanly, boss lady like. I just, I just love these so much. And I'll show you guys actually with the white blazer. Um, I haven't tried this look on yet, so I don't know if I'll go exactly right, but I feel like that could still be a look. Honestly, like this is not even bad together. Like I would like this too. Um, this white little cropped blazer with the pants. I find them really cute as well. 
Um, I like this little outfit together. I wouldn't pair these ones with the taupe color because I feel like it would clash, like camel and taupe. I don't think that goes together as well. But I feel like with the white, again, like super easy to pair. So I feel like you can't go wrong with those pair of pants and the blazers. Like I just love this outfit together. Um, but I got these ones and these ones I will say do have a linen-like fabric, which is very nice for the summertime, but I actually don't know the exact material mix of these pants. I'll have to find out from the website and I'll try to put it down below. Um, let me see if I can see it. So these ones, again, I got them in a size extra small and I'll show you guys better. Size extra small and it retails for $49.90. And these ones are those. So they do seem a little bit more see-through. I would obviously wear something that is um, skin color, so like a nude pair of underwear. And then they're just super simple at the back. They do have a much wider um, leg than the one I'm wearing right now. The one that I'm wearing right now is more of like a cinch than at the waist and then a little bit tighter on the leg and then it goes into a wider flare. Whereas that one is like a straight like poof <laughs> at the bottom. And then I also got them in a camel color, which differs a little bit from the one that I'm wearing right now like what I'm wearing is a little bit darker but I also like this color as well so let me try these two on and then we'll be done for this so this is the first pair on and these are the camel colored ones as I mentioned they are pretty huge on me it kind of looks like it's like swallowing me right now <laughs> but um, what I want to do is I definitely want to keep them because I feel like I like the weights um, cinched at the waist and it, that it holds up the only thing is I'll get them tailored to fit better on the leg but these are so perfect perfect for the summertime. I really do have to check and let you guys know if it has linen because I really feel like it's a linen finish and I just find them like super easy to pair with just anything. They look elegant. It's like form fitting at the waist but then it goes like it flows very nicely so you'll have like a nice little like air and flow in the leg area during the spring and summertime so I feel like these are definitely perfect. Um, I just absolutely love them. I don't know exactly what I would pair with but I feel like a very nice fitted um, white bodysuit could look very cute or also like a sort of a girly little top that would be cute. I would picture it with like nice sunglasses and a big hat like you know one of those sun hats like oh that would look so gorgeous. I'm just waiting for the warm weather because like these are perfect. I put on the white version and I'm actually um, not wearing heels with this one because I just want to show you guys how big it is without heels just in case you're the same height as me and want reference and this is how it would be with high heels so as I said for the camel one I will get them cut a little bit so I'll do that on these ones too and I do want to show you actually a detail that I forgot to mention um, but it's nice attention to detail from their end they have a sort of like rubberized non-slip waistband um, all over the waistline here. I don't know how much you can see, but if you feel it, it's almost like, it's not uncomfortable. I don't feel it at all, but I feel like it's a nice way to make sure that the waist doesn't like drop down. I guess if you buy a size um, a little bit bigger, but you want the waist to still hold on nice and tight at the top, it can definitely do that. Um, I just love these ones. I do think that they're a little bit see-through um, just because I can see the sticker <laughs> like on the side right here, but I don't think you can see my underwear or anything, hopefully not. Um, but again, obviously with these ones, I would wear nude underwear, but I absolutely love these. I feel like these are a really great staple. Again, I think it's like that linen fabric that's just so breathable and perfect for the summer and spring. So you will definitely, definitely see me wearing these with a whole bunch of crop tops a whole bunch of little blazers. I'm super excited about these ones. So yeah. Yes, so we've reached the end of today's video. I hope you guys love those pieces as much as I did. It was just really fun picking all of these up in the last few weeks. I did make three orders actually. I didn't make all of the purchases at once because I was trying different sizing and things. So I'll have all of my measurements and the sizing and the links of everything that's not sold down down below in the description. If you have any question, feel free to ask me in the comments. I always answer you guys. So just let me know down there and I'm really grateful that you've watched the whole way through. Make sure to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already done so. And I'll see you guys in the next one.